The EU just pushed through the new copyright directive despite massive protests and despite pretty much everyone except the lobbyists and the content mafia telling them to fuck off. And I'm fucking tired. I'm so tired. But you know what? I'll keep continuing this. And I don't care if anyone listens or doesn't listen. I'll talk and I'll talk. Because as long as these assholes keep throwing, screwing us over. Well. I'll keep telling them to fuck off. So in a little more detail. Um. Uh, a last vote was taken on whether or not they would um, they would try to institute any changes and fi- um, this was declined by five votes and then the actual uh, the actual vote on the copyright directive was accepted by I think 300 20 something votes to 270 votes and um, yesterday it came out that Germany actually wanted to add in more exceptions to the directive but France was against it and they cut a deal with France in order to get their support on the new North Stream 2 pipeline that they want so desperately to get more gas because we need that fucking gas because fuck nature fuck everything yay industry yay lobbies yay the 6,000 lobbies that live in Brussels and keep influencing the decisions of the European Parliament far more than the uh, the act their actually con- their actual constituency. Uh, yay, we have a new fucking copyright law that makes no fucking sense, and that will fuck over all the fucking startups, and just crystallize the power over the internet in a few more uh, in a few hands that can actually afford to do the things that are now um, imperative thanks to this new copyright directive and yeah of course this will handicap the actual economic interests of the European Union not the interests of the powerful lobbies but the interests of the startups and the interests of anyone that wants to do anything concerning the internet and concerning this new digital industry that we have and that now blossoms in the US and will just further degenerate within the EU because of this new fucking reform. Yeah. I'll definitely update you on who voted in what way. Um, what we know is that the SPU um, representatives and the representatives of the German SPD said that they would vote against the reform. Um, and at least a few of them did. We'll look, I'll look further into that as soon as more information arrives. What we also know is that the um, FPÖ um, declined to vote. Yeah, those guys have fucking balls. Absolutely. It absolutely shows how dedicated they are to the freedom of the internet or anything or anyone. And... (laughs) <laughs> the primary portal is called uncensored, uh, so uncensored. Um, they'll have to change that. Um, of course, it wasn't really uncensored before. It was just right-wing garbage, but 
it was also censored of course by the Austrian um, censorship laws but apart from that uh, there is a last hope which is the um, um, yeah. what's the English term the EUGH the European Court for um, the European Court <laughs> um, and they'll have to decide um, there's already um, a lawsuit against the law and there is a precedent which was set which says that um, upload filters are uh, uncon um, are against uh, current um, US <laughs> EU constitutional law not constitutional but against the EU treaties and while the law does while the new EU copyright law doesn't directly say anything about upload filters the only practical way to to police the content in the way the um, copyright directive dictates is through upload filters so there's some hope but I wouldn't really hope too much um, apart from that I want you to remember this when the next EU Parliament elections come around which is in exactly two months and I want you to not just tell those people to fuck off but to actually vote them out that's pretty much the only thing we can do and apart from that I'm just so tired I mean what's the fucking use of doing anything if the, those fucking assholes just keep fucking us over seriously they don't care they don't give a shit about any of us they care about their fucking pipeline because that brings in fucking millions into their fucking pockets they don't care about us they don't care about nature they don't care about the environment they don't care about startups they don't care about themselves and they care about the fucking lobbyists that give them money and that's it that's the truth <laughs>